Hi, I'm Stacy Peterson, and I'm the director of the AgriSolar Clearinghouse. AgriSolar is the co-location of agriculture and solar. Today we're going to talk about solar and crop co-location. Here are five things to know about solar and crops. Number one, plants get more sunlight than they actually need. Even in the shade of solar panels, crops still receive the light they need to grow. Solar panels that move on tracking systems and follow the sun allow the crops to receive ample sunshine and protection from extreme temperatures and excessive evapotranspiration. Number two, having plants under the panels actually increases the energy produced. The microclimate created by the crops creates a cooler temperature for the solar panels, which operate more efficiently at lower temperatures. It's a win for the solar panels and it's a win for the crops. Number three, growing under panels can lead to greater yields and longer growing seasons. Farmers across the country have seen greater yields and longer growing seasons, particularly for cold season crops like lettuce, which can grow well into the heat of summer. The protection of the solar panel smooths out temperature fluctuations. They decrease high temperatures in the summer and they increase cooler temperatures in the fall and spring. Number four, Growing crops under solar panels dramatically decreases water usage. The cooler temperatures and reduced evapotranspiration under the solar panels lead to a dramatic decrease in irrigation. In Oregon, they're able to grow water-intensive crops like melons, squash, and tomatoes under panels without any irrigation. In Arizona, they've seen a 75% decrease in irrigation for tomatoes, beans, basils, and peppers. Number five, the shade of the solar panels is great for farm workers. We took skin temperature readings around the country and saw a 15 to 20 degree skin temperature drop beneath the solar panels. This is a huge difference considering heat stroke is the leading cause of death of farm workers in the United States. Thanks so much for watching. You can learn more about solar and crops at the AgriSolar Clearinghouse. We also have great explainer videos about solar grazing and solar and pollinator and beekeeping.